Hey guys, what's up? This is Eric. I'm here for my final video of 2011. Alright, you might have have seen on my Facebook that I have gotten an iPad for Christmas. And that's exactly what I'm using now. It's a 16 gig iPad 2. I'm very, very happy to have this. I have been using it for the whole entire day. I've been on Facebook on it, on YouTube. I, I have just been having an absolute blast with my iPad. So, I can kiss this thing goodbye. This is a camera what I have been using for like a long ass time. I've had this camera ever since I was in 7th grade. I got it for Christmas a long time ago. But now you can kiss it goodbye. Yeah, I really need to clean my room. It's kind of a, of a mess. I haven't even made my bed. So yeah, um, let's get started. I'll show you guys what I got for my birthday and for Christmas. I'll show you guys some games I got. I got Mortal Kombat, and I hear that Freddy Cougar is a downloadable character on, on this game, which I'm, which I'm pretty excited for. I, I'm excited to play this game. I've already played this one this morning. Most of you know that I'm a Sonic fan, Sonic Generations. This game is pretty sweet. Now where did I put them? Oh yeah, a bunch of iTunes cards, so I can buy more songs and all that shit. Uh, Best Buy gift card. I got a ton of gift cards and ton of money, so expect me in my next video, which will, which will be in 2012. Um, here's a card that I got from my older brother. It's pretty funny. Hey, it took your mind off turning another year older, didn't it? <laughs> pretty funny. So, um, next up is some CDs I got. I got Nickelback's new CD, Here and Now. I've heard that Bottoms Up song, and it's it's a pretty good song. Theodore's Down's new CD, I, I haven't heard any of the songs on it, but I'm pretty excited to listen to it. I, I got that white t-shirt over there, but trust me, it's nothing special. And for my birthday, I got a $50 gift card to Amazon, and I got a ton of DVDs, which I'll show you here pretty soon. And I did not expect to get this at all, but I got cologne. Wow. And I also got yet another gift card to Amazon for $30. Holy crap. I'm going to be getting a lot of new shit. I got this from my dad's mom, a $50 gift card to Walmart. Holy crap, I'm just loaded with gift cards. More gift cards. Oh yes, and to, to all of you who have asked me if I have Xbox Live, well, it's officially going to be renewed. Um, my Xbox Live has been expired ever since I, my sophomore year, and I'm a senior now, so it really is about time that I get it, you know, renewed. So, so yeah, um, whenever I get it renewed, I'll either make a video about it or I'll post it on Facebook if you have me, if you have me as, as a friend. Money, more cards. Shit, I dropped it. Better pick it up. <laughs> right, I'll show you a bunch of movies I got. Oh yeah, this shelf now is officially all filled up. Yep, it's all filled up. Show you guys some movies I got. <sighs> this I got off of off of Amazon. Avengers of Sonic the Hedgehog, Volume 1. You can call me childish all you want, but fuck you. Oh, fuck it, I can't get back in. The Fly Collector Set, which includes the remake with Jeff Goldblum. And the sequel. The sequel, I mean the... the I can't talk today. The remake's good, but the sequel... Eh, it's not, you know, the worst piece of shit ever made, but... So there's some stuff that I liked, but some stuff which is terrible. This I got from a gift card that I got from a next door neighbor for my birthday. $20 gift card to Target. The Human Centipede first sequence. Blu-ray. I got this for Christmas. I saw this at the theater. I have a poster of it right there. Yep, you guessed it. Super 8. Good movie. Now here's all the Blu-rays I got. Wait a minute, I forgot one DVD. South Park, the complete first season. 
I got that for Christmas. Let's get started on all the Blu-rays. South Park, Bigger, Longer, and Uncut. I remember that me and my friend Caleb saw, saw this on TV on New Year's back in the 8th grade a long time ago. And that was back when we weren't supposed to watch South Park. But yeah, this will bring back a lot of memories. Fast Five on Blu-ray with the DVD and digital copy. I saw this on, on the first day it came out. It's definitely one of the better Fast and the Furious movies, but yet it's not, you know, it, it it's not my favorite movie of 2011. But I'll show you my favorite movie of 2011 here pretty soon, which I got on Blu-ray. Some of you are going to call me a, a child for getting this on Blu-ray. I got it on DVD last year for Christmas. Now I got it on Blu-ray. All right. I kind of have the feeling like that some trolls on here are going to give me shit for it. But if you're going to give me shit for it, for it, well, fuck you. Lion King on Blu-ray. Great movie. Never ever gets old. I saw this at the, at the theater too. Cowboys and Aliens. Really, really good movie. Well, it's not a perfect movie. It's more of like a fun action summer film. It's definitely no Citizen Kane or anything, but... Now, my favorite film of 2011 is right here. Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Now, this is definitely the best movie of 2011. Fuck, all these Facebook notifications just keep popping up. I saw this at the theater twice. Thor, and I also saw Rise of the Planet of the Apes twice at the theater. Thor was good, but that was better. Two more Blu-rays left. In the Sleepy Hollow. And, yes, I now own all the Scream films. Scream 4 on Blu-ray. Yep, that shelf over there is all filled up. No, I have half of a shelf here. Then, after that, I have one more shelf. Then, after I fill those two up, I'm going to have to get a new shelf. All right, let's move over here. I forgot to show you guys this one in my last DVD update. In October, there was a zombie carnival, and a bunch of local people made a zombie movie. And they were selling their local zombie movie there on DVD. Here it is, way darker than you think. I have met all the people who have made this movie, like Trevor Styles and all them people, and they're pretty and they're pretty cool people. Holy crap! It's all filled up now. Holy shit! Here's some more of what I got off of Amazon. The Thing, John Carpenter's version, definitely better than the recent prequel. Return of the Living Dead. I watched this one early this morning. I also reviewed it during my horror movie marathon season two. Oh yeah, I I got this one a few months ago also. I spit on your grave unrated. Me and a couple friends watched it at a friend's house, and wow, this movie's brutal and disturbing. As it says, if you can handle it, see it. And I got this one for Christmas also. I was expecting it to get it on the Blu-ray format, but. I got it on DVD, but hey, at least I got it. I asked for it. Captain America, the first Avenger. Good. Good movie. Alright. So that's what I got for Christmas. I'm pretty satisfied with what I got. Hold up, I forgot to mention. I also got a new editing software. So I'll no longer be using Windows Movie Maker. Thank God. I hated using that. So anyways, that's what I got for Christmas. I'm pretty happy with what I got. Expect me to expect me to get if um some more movies um whenever whenever they come in from Amazon or from Best Buy or Walmart. So yeah, this is my first video on, on my iPad. I freaking love it. I hope you guys had a very merry Christmas and I hope you guys have a happy new year. I'll see you guys when I return in 2012, the year I graduate.